There's never been a time in our industry where our collective opportunity is as large as it is today to unleash the power of data across the cloud, the network, and the edge. This moment is shaped by four inflections, the proliferation of cloud architectures, the rise of AI, the shift to 5G, and the growth of the edge. Cloud architecture started within the data center to deliver new levels of efficiency and scale, and they're now transforming the network and the edge. AI is becoming pervasive across all applications, unlocking new opportunity for insight. And 5G networks are utilizing cloud-like architectures to deliver a range of network agility and performance never seen before. And 5G, in turn, opens up the opportunity for computing at the edge, at the location of highest return. Intel's unique role in this moment is clear. We're investing to deliver an unmatched portfolio to move, store, and process the world's data. Today, we're unveiling exciting new products, starting with enhancements to our second generation Xeon scalable processors and extending to 5G networks with the industry's first Intel architecture system on a chip for wireless base stations, the first Intel 5G enabled ASICs and structured ASICs, and the first Intel network adapter designed for 5G. Let's start with Xeon. Continuous innovation never ceases at Intel, even after the introduction of products into the marketplace. It's part of delivering decades of Xeon platforms to customers. And while the second generation Xeon scalable processor has been wildly successful and our fastest ramping Xeon in history, we knew we could do more. Today, we are enhancing the portfolio with new SKUs delivering industry-leading frequency and improved customer value. These new offerings are perfect for customers seeking processors for workloads across the cloud, the network, and the edge, and deliver up to 36% more performance and 42% more performance per dollar versus the previous generation. We expect hundreds of new solutions based on these SKUs from our customers and partners arriving in market starting today. The second generation Xeon Scalable features unique capabilities, including integrated AI acceleration, Optane persistent memory, hardware enhanced security, and network optimizations. The so-called NSKUs are processors designed specifically tuned for virtualized network functions, delivering up to 58% more performance versus the prior generation. And customers are responding. Customers such as CenturyLink, China Mobile, SKT, and Sprint have already initiated deployments. The Xeon Scalable Processor has served as the foundation for core network transformation. Intel has worked with communication service providers and industry leaders since the development of NFE standards to deliver virtual networks based on Xeon processors. Today, over 50% of core networks are being deployed in a virtualized fashion, growing to 80% by 2024. This has helped fuel Intel's ascent to become the world's number one network silicon provider in a market forecast to grow to $25 billion by 2023. While network transformation began at the core, the next major innovation target is the edge. As operators look to support new low latency services, we've engaged the industry to define the technology that will fuel solutions such as virtualized RANs. Today, we're seeing incredible traction with VRAN with leading operators, including China Mobile, China Telecom, Rakuten, and Telefonica, driving trials and early deployments. We have also been collaborating with 5G leaders to design the world's first standard high volume silicon for radio access networks. And today, we're announcing the 10 nanometer Intel Atom P5900 processor, designed from the ground up for 5G wireless base stations and bringing Intel architecture to this market for the first time. This product was designed for 5G's high bandwidth and low latency and combines compute, 100 gigabits of connectivity and acceleration into a single SOC. It delivers a performance punch in packet security throughput and improved packet balancing throughput versus using software alone. Plus, with IA, Intel architecture consistent from the core to the edge, customers can realize high economies of scale and software reuse throughout the network. Our customers have responded, and we expect leading providers, including Ericsson, Nokia, 
and ZTE to deliver solutions based on this platform. We're also excited to report that the reception from our customers of the Atom P5900 platform has pulled in our forecasts to grow our market segment share to an industry leading 40% from 2022 to 2021. This SOC is a tremendous breakthrough, but customers also require solutions that enable them to customize their platforms. Intel has the broadest product portfolio to support our customers in this effort, from custom ASICs and structured ASICs to FPGAs. Together, these products provide a platform foundation that only Intel can deliver. Today, we're augmenting our robust accelerator portfolio with the first Intel structured ASIC designed for 5G networks, Diamond Mesa. Diamond Mesa is footprint compatible with our Intel FPGAs, while at the same time delivering 2x the performance and 50% lower power than the previous generation products. We're starting early customer testing now and we expect deployments next year. Finally, we're introducing the Intel Ethernet 700 series network adapter with hardware enhanced precision timing protocols. This technology increases timing precision for cross network service synchronization, an important technology for the 5G edge. And this product will ship in the second quarter. Today, we've announced an unmatched silicon portfolio for 5G networks. We've enhanced our second gen Xeon scalable processors. We've introduced the first Intel architecture SOC for wireless base stations with the Atom P5900, the first 5G network structured ASIC with Diamond Mesa, and the first 5G enabled network adapter, our Ethernet 700 series. Congratulations to our customers and our partners. We can't wait to see your solutions unleash the power of data around the world. Thank you for your time today. Thank you.